Real quick, hey, could you describe what a dirt bag is, dirt bag is to us? I, I think there's a sense of spirit about the player. There's a sense of there's personality that is able to be shown through while he's competing. And just a guy that even if his day gets off to a really bad start, you're never going to really know that. And he just continues to play. We don't want a bunch of Eddie Haskells rolling around. Mm -hmm. I know that's a little or old for some people. And Do just... you guys know who Eddie Haskell is? Yeah, from Leave it to Beaver. So those Eddie Haskells are they're, they're great while they're in front of you, but they're nothing like that when they're not in front of you. I've never seen Leave it to Beaver, but I've seen 8 Mile. And in the rap battle at the end, uh, you ever seen 8 Mile with Eminem? I have not. The, at the rap sorry. battle at the end, they talk about Eddie Haskell, and that's the only reason that I know. I think you were a little hard on the Beaver. So was Eddie Haskell, Wally, and Miss Cleaver. There you go. So that's you good go. enough. Thanks. Let's get back. Let's recap that Texas series. Let's get real passionate here. Best series of all time, right? Oh, wow. Yeah, I mean, within the top probably three, four, five. I mean. <laughs> Wait, in baseball history? Yeah, well, you had for, Sox, for Yankees. Long Beach State. <laughs> oh, oh, you're talking about baseball lore? No, yeah. no. It was a dirtbag series. I mean, you know, you, you, you play a really good game against Texas, you lose, and you got to file through the loser's bracket. And those are, those are what, those are epic stuff that you talk about for a long, long time. I wasn't part of the whole make fun of uh, Clemens. Yeah, that wasn't me. Yeah, that, that wasn't very, that was unprofessional by us. And I don't think puts Oops. a really good light on you know, our, our, who we are and what we're all about, that's for sure. What's the expectation going into this season? I, I think they're always high, you know, regardless of experience and, you know, so on and so forth. We we have a lot of guys back. Now, we, we've gotten bitten by the injury bug, and I never like commenting on it. But at the same time, you know, we got to evolve and figure out what kind of team we're going to be, too. But I'm looking forward to the year because of I love adversity. I mean, I do. What, what are the pros and cons in your mind of playing college versus uh, minor leagues out of high school? It's a lot more of a J-O-B in professional baseball. Um, professional baseball adds more reps, so it gives you a better chance to, if you really want to just major in baseball, then sign. But most guys aren't ready emotionally, maturity-wise, and they're not talented enough physically or mentally to be able to do that on a daily basis. It is a long, long grind. We play this game with everybody. It got a, it's a quick game. Uh, it's called, are you a better coach than? Question mark. Yeah, well, I, 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 I would probably refrain. With, also, yeah, yeah, but if you don't say anything, then it's a, it's a yes. yes. Uh, so, number one, uh, Pat Casey at Oregon State. Yeah, he's, no, you're right, you're, you're better than him. He's, uh, he, oh. he's a little overrated. Uh, what about uh, what about your boy uh, Gillespie at UCI? No. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, he's, are, he's, are, old, are, he's old. He's old. He's old. You're right. You're right. What about Savage at UCLA? No, <laughs> absolutely not. They're boring though. No, they're not. They're, they're they're they've won national championships. Okay. So when you win a national championship, you're on you a different there. level. You got me there. What would your walk-up song be if you were a uh, coaching walk-up song? Ooh, good song. The song is playing right now. I like it. Really? What is it? I'm still Come on. Okay. Who sings well, this? I couldn't hear it. Who sings it? Sounds like a... Uh... Five seconds. Oh, yeah. No. Wrong. <laughs> One, two, John, three. Uh, Toto. Four. No. I, still, I can't even hear it. I Come don't... on. He's retiring from touring. Uh, Bill Collins. Uh, no. John, Den no. John Denver. John Denver's... Passed away. <laughs> Damn it, Elton John. Oh, okay. oh, this is Elton John. Oh, Correct. yeah, yeah, the, the piano man. <laughs> it's Billy Joel, but that's by, it's okay. But we know who Eminem is, so we're good. <laughs> <laughs> we'll let you. We'll let you make up for what you uh, just said. Uh, how much do you hate Fullerton on a scale of one to ten? I don't hate. Fullerton. Infinity. I respect Fullerton. I mean, is this what you're telling your guys in the locker room before the game? Hey guys, let's uh, let's let's go. We'll answer that for you. Pat them on the butt. I guess you guys. The game. Are, you are answering that for me. Go ahead. It sounds question. like you need to hire us to like be your speech givers because we have a lot of hatred in us. It's not healthy. I know. Maybe that's why you have coffee stains on you. 